your car, you cut me off, you I cut you off? A tense interaction at the corner of Main Street East in Ottawa yesterday afternoon. The one person seen here getting in the face of the couple filming the entire incident. The couple are a white man and a black woman. While the men share verbal jabs, in a split second, the woman becomes the focus. Wow, what did you say? Say that again! No physical interaction takes place. Both cars go their separate ways. And despite the person behind the phone threatening to call police, nothing happens. However, the video was eventually posted online, went viral, and Hamilton police started investigating. So the Hamilton police became aware of a video that was going viral, uh, displaying uh, some hatred slurs to, towards an individual. Uh, the Hamilton police just earlier this morning put out a media release and uh, we were successful in getting a response from our complainant. Uh, short, about an hour ago, we spoke to the complainant. The man shown in the video spoke with CHCH in person to explain himself. While he didn't want to appear on camera, he did share that his family had been going through a very difficult situation at home. He took to his Facebook page to attempt to make amends, saying, quote, I apologize wholeheartedly for my words and actions, and if someone knows the couple in question, I'd like to apologize to them in person because there is no excuse to use that racist term under any circumstances. Hamilton police say no charges have been laid. Been classified as a uh, hatred incident, and uh, no charges are being laid at this time. Uh, but this information is vital to the Hamilton Police Service as it helps us create a, an image or a picture of what hatred looks like in Hamilton. Lyndon George, the executive director of Hamilton's Anti-Racism Resource Center, says these incidents cut deep. The, these words are used in a hateful way to not only harm them, but to harm their loved ones as well. That they are saying this as if uh, that they're in a position of power to say, yeah, you know, you are this. Uh, that you are less than. And it is, it's that type of rhetoric and hateful speech that makes people feel like they're not a part of our community. And so that's that, that, that part that we have to call out, that people need to feel safe. Wow, what did you say? Say that again! They shouldn't have to encounter that. Uh, and that individual lives and works here in Hamilton. And so it's not just about that moment, but how we hold people accountable when they use those hurtful words against people. The Hamilton Anti-Racism Resource Center found out that the man works at Hamilton Health Sciences. The employer confirmed that with CHCH and say that he's on leave as they investigate. As it stands, someone using a racial slur is considered a hate incident, not a crime. A hate crime would have to include a criminal act that is motivated solely by bias, prejudice, or hate towards a specific group.